Martin joins us now with our forecast. Looks like we have an unsettled week ahead of us. We huh? do, yeah. Mm. Not quite a soaker like we saw mm -hmm. yesterday, mm -hmm. but rain chances probably every day. But hey, I guess we're getting used to it by now. If you got a new umbrella, it's getting a lot of use. And yeah, tomorrow we do have a chance at a hit or miss thunderstorm, but we will might actually see the sun coming out. But right now, I know, right? All is quiet right now as we get a live look at Center City, Philadelphia. We do have clouds in place and fog that will be settling in as we head into the overnight period as a warm front makes an approach and will boost our temperatures big time as we return to work after the holiday weekend. But yeah, closing out our holiday weekend on the cool side, our high temperature only 71 in Philadelphia, above average or below average. We should be in the upper 70s, only 60s down the shore today, only stopped at 64 degrees in Wildwood. We got into the 70s in Allentown and one of our warmer spots, 74 in Redding. Temperatures right now generally in the 60s across much of the area, closing in on 50s in Wildwood, 61 degrees. We're at 66 in Philadelphia and 61 degrees currently in Mount Pocono. Overnight tonight, temperatures though won't fall too far, only a couple more degrees, 65 with the clouds in place and fog developing. Southwesterly winds at around 5 miles per hour, so wind speeds pretty light throughout the overnight period. And then for the day tomorrow, starting off with that fog, do watch out for reduced visibility in the morning if you have to hit the road after the weekend and then temperatures climbing up to 88 degrees tomorrow. We will see a period of sunshine, but do watch out for the chance of a hit or miss shower or thunderstorm as we head into the afternoon. Storm scan three pretty quiet right now, even seeing some clear sky conditions up towards the Poconos. A few more clouds closer to the city and points southward, but clear has not been the trend for this May so far. Over five inches of rainfall in Philadelphia, running two inches above the average just for this month. And then check this out. Days this month with a trace or more of rainfall. 15 of them and yes we do have more rain chances as we head into the next several days particularly on Thursday tomorrow just a chance of a hit or miss shower or thunderstorm but keep that umbrella on standby a shower possible on Wednesday mainly west of the city with high pressure and control off to the east and then we will see an increased rain and storm threat as we head into Thursday this area of low pressure the remnant low from Alberto could pour, provide a little bit more moisture and enhance that rain chance as we head into Thursday and Friday but in your forecast for tomorrow Mainly dry conditions, but again, keep an eye to the sky for a chance of an isolated storm. Otherwise, a much warmer day up to 82 degrees, but that ocean temperature still pretty chilly at 59. But temperatures warm all across the area tomorrow, climbing into the 80s in the Poconos. We'll top at 82 degrees in Trenton, a high temperature of 85. Big difference as we head into the day tomorrow in Wilmington. Then temperatures take a step back closer to average as we head into Tuesday and Wednesday. As we head into Thursday, or excuse me, Wednesday and Thursday. As we head into Thursday, a pretty good shot at some showers and storms. Same case on Friday as we kick off the month of June. And looks like the start of next weekend. Hey, guess what? Uh-oh. More rain and storms uh -oh. in the oh, forecast. On, oh, and there's your prize. <laughs>